for our football program, we are an FCS program, a Division I program. We are a need-based program, meaning we don't have football scholarships to give to individuals. But our recruiting pitch is, you come to Dayton, you're going to have a Division I experience. And we have Division I first-class facilities in which they want to participate and be a part of while they're here at Dayton. And talking about facilities, that's a part of it. But the other part of it is, how is your uh, program covered? What kind of media coverage do you get here? And here at Dayton, it's a Division One. Jeff Pecora, I'm joined now by Rick Chamberlain, the head coach of the Dayton football team. Unreal. You know, it, I can't really put it into words right now. It's giving us a lot of confidence uh, being able to come back. It shows you how our team just keeps fighting, keeps fighting. The video, the Facebook, the Twitter, everything is captured on video or print and it is put out throughout the nation. So people hear about the University of Dayton and that's because of the strong staff that we have here, both in our video department and in our sports information. We are a Division I program when it comes to the coverage. And along with that then is also the community coverage we get from the local TV and radio. Every one of our football games is on radio, uh, hosted by Larry Hanskin and Mike Kelly, a College Hall of Fame football coach as the caller man. Over the middle, intercepted by Dayton. Come on, baby. They run it inside. And He's breaking the tackle. He's going to go. Breaking the tackle. He's, He's going to go. go. He's at the 20, Come on, 15, baby. 10, 5. Yeah. Touchdown. Yeah. Touchdown. Hot diggity dog, baby. Ah. Touchdown. Hot diggity dog. And then we were on Time Warner twice this year. We were on ESPN three times this year. So that is the Division One experience that our athletes get to enjoy here. When it comes to promoting your program, both uh, within the community and nationally, you've got to have your name out there. And the outlets that people will see is cable TV, is that idea on ESPN and Time Warner, in which they got to see some exciting games. Uh, Connor Kasser in a record-setting game against Duquesne winning the PFL championship against Maris with the crowd that was there, the excitement right down to the last play of the game. People remember the University of Dayton, and that's what you want to do. You want to catch their attention, and the media outlet with Time Warner and with ESPN really does the job there. The benefits that we tell our recruits when they're trying to decide where they want to go to college, and we're trying to convince them that Dayton is the place they want to come to, Number one is they're going to be a part of a winning tradition. We've had 39 out of 40 years of a winning record. And not just winning records, but championship records. And players want to go places where they can win. So the uh, winning tradition here is attractive. Then secondly, what we tell them their benefit of being here is they're going to be in a Division I experience. From facilities to media coverage, to support staff, to travel, it's all Division I form. And that it, it's going to be worth the time and the investment to be here, to be a part of that program. And then thirdly, it is the idea when you graduate from the University of Dayton, and our players graduate, they are going to have many opportunities when it comes to a career. Because employers out there, they're anxious to get UD graduates and especially UD football graduates there. Our placement percentage for our football players right now is at 98% after graduation. So we're pretty proud of that figure also.